following is a Cold TV special presentation. Greetings and salutations, everybody. It's I, XLJ, the OG, along here with Mr. B-Roll, and we are on the road again. So we're on a road trip here, heading to Chicago. Chicago. And thought I would take Mr. B-Roll here to a place he's never been. We are here in Merrifield, Indiana, to check out the Albanese Candy Factory, which Albanese Candy is world famous for making some of the most delicious gummy bears you ever have. Cause I'm a gummy bear. So on a scale of one to ten, like one lowest, ten highest, how would you say like your gummy bear fandom is? I love me some gummy bears, so on a scale of one to ten, probably say a seven. Hmm. I'm not a huge gummy bear person, but these gummy bears are delicioso. Yes. So we're gonna go head on in and check it out. Uh, and maybe, who knows, we can get lucky and they'll give us like a little tour or something. Because I think they sometimes do tours here, but it's probably something we've got to schedule. But anyways, we're going to go in and check it out nonetheless. So. Get some gummy bears. All right, let's go. All right, and here we make it to the Albanese Candy Factory on this rainy day. Now, the Albanese Candy Factory has been around for over 30 years. And they make some of the world's best gummies as well as chocolates, as you see right here. And I gotta say, I am digging and respecting these patriotic spreads they got here. But here is the moneymaker, folks. The world-famous gummies. You got gummy bears, gummy worms. Ooh, and look at this chocolate. Daddy likey. And I have to say, I think the Albanese Candy Factory does a great job with all these pre-packaging um, sets they have here. But, of course, candy's not all they got. Check out the merch. Look at those cute little gummy bear stickers. And check this out. I love me some old school candy bars. And they've got it here at the Albanese Candy Factory. Kind of mixed in with some other stuff too. But just some candy you don't see every... Oh, what the fuck. Anyway. But yeah, look at this. Hawaiian punch candy. You don't see that every day. And oh, check this out. This is so cool. Look at the Boba Fett candy. Uh, yeah, we nerded out over that. Oh, man, check out all those cow tails they got. I love those things back in the day. But, yeah, this just kind of goes on and on. And wait a minute. I spotted something. Gummy bear one's kind of cool. Hey, bro. Bro. I must ask you a question. <laughs> so, what'd you find? Chocolate wand, if you will. You're a delicious wizard, Harry. And check out this, novelty lightsabers too. They got a little bit of everything here, but here we go. Some gummy gummy gummies. And I think those are like a different type than the green packaging. Oh, and of course you gotta have the peach rings and the gummy worms, come on, man. And we love us some red vines. We do, we do, we do, ooh. And I'm always really focused on the gummies, but man, there's a lot of chocolate candies here that I bet are delicioso. And boy, does this bring back memories as a kid. You remember going to the supermarket and just taking a big old scoop and getting pounds of candy that would rot your teeth? Ah, those were the days, friends. Those were the days. Look how professional this is here. I mean, my God, look at all that chocolate. But yeah, you just go in and you just pick out whatever the heck you want. And you've got all your uh, candy experts, I guess. Go and weigh it and get it for you, man. And this place was popping, as you can tell. Oh, look at all these gummies over here. Yummy, yummy, yummy. I know, I remember these jawbreaker suckers, man. They were brutal as a kid. Oh, check it out. They got the little Coke bottle thingies or the soda pop bottles or whatever you call them. And I love that they're in sandwich bags. That's awesome. And look at those gummies on selection. Holy guacamole, man. Oh, my God. It just goes on forever and ever. What do you think, B-roll? <laughs> That's not bad. Three forty-nine a pound? I bet you a small bag is maybe a pound. I don't know. Well, like nine ounces. That's not even a pound, right? Yeah. 16 ounces is a pound. Yeah. Oh, look at those gummies. Oh, 
All right, and that's going to wrap it up for our trip here to Albany's Candy Factory. Right. Let's see what we got. And that was the Albany's Candy Factory. What'd you think? Very cool, and it smelled delicious in there. Yeah, it did smell pretty awesome. So, of course, we got them out with some stuff. If you were all proper like, and you got the stuff straight up, like fresh from the bar. From the bar. So, what'd you get? Uh, I like lots of stuff. These are sherbet gummy bears. Neat. Watermelon rings. Neat. And blue raspberry. Neato ring. burrito. What I, did you get, sir? I got lazy and didn't feel like waiting, so I got the Ori package, but it's packaged here, so. Gotta have the gummy worms, the sweet and sour though. Yes. So I'm excited as hell about these. I almost got them. Uh, excited about these two. I think this is a highly underrated. You gotta get the peach rings. Which I was going to, but he got those, so I did. And of course, I'd be reminisced if I did not get the traditional, get the traditional gummy bear. Wanna try some of these? Let's try them. Let's I need me a sour gummy. See if I get the same Man, you. smell them. You smell them. Mm. Oh, it's two fur. Wow. You're you're a firm believer in that. If they come out like that, you eat both, right? You have to. That's a heart gun. And it's gluten free. I feel like a kid again. Getting right into the peach rings. I need that in my life. Okay. Ooh, baby. So so we do the worms, and then we'll do all the ring ones, and then we'll do the um, bears. I'm just eating them. Ah! The super! Mmm. Mmm. Peachy king. Mm-hmm. Can't be a peach ring. Mm-mm. What we got here? Watermelon. Do the watermelon crow. Watermelon chicka. Hi. Yeah. Rings are where it's at. I like the rings. Mm -hmm. so one more ring to try. So what's this one? Blue raspberry. Blue raspberry. Oh yeah. Let's close them. Very nice. And now to the classic gummies. I'm gonna go classic, classic first. Or? No, just what you got. I'm just saying the gummy is first texture. Yeah, I'm guessing they're just flavors. Yeah. Thunder. You see, the little guy. Sherbert. These are sherbert. I thought these were nice. Oh wow. Mmm. Oh yeah. Yeah, Queen. Give me some more. That's pretty good. I can dig it. I'm going to say on the rings, though, nothing beat the peach. The others were good, but, were nothing, good. but nothing beat the nothing peach. Nothing beats the peach. And finally, the tried and true classic gummy. What they are well over down for. I like the sherbet ones. So oh, yeah, good. the sherbet's hit. I don't know. I always did that too. And then you bite the head off. I was going to say that. And you're like, no, no, don't eat me. This is why we're friends. <laughs> True story. Sure. You want some more? Some more what? Gummy bears. <laughs> well, there you go. Does a heart good to know that there is a place in this world? makes gummy bears. It's a specifically a gummy bear factory and it's in our neck of the woods or in our home state anyway. Yep. Yep. So there you go. That's that my heart good. was Albany's Candy Factory. That was one of our stops here on the road. So speaking of which we better get back on the road. Let's go. Because we got go. plenty more yummy yums to put in the tummy town. Yep.